In this video, we are going to be comparing the 10 most popular types of excavators, delving into size, price, and best uses. Continue watching this video to find out more. Number one is the standard excavators. Standard excavators, also known as crawler excavators, are the most common type of machine out there in the market. They are mounted on tracks as these are very helpful in the rough terrain that they are usually found in. The rotating cab allows the operator to move the boom in a full circle without repositioning the actual machine. These excavators can be fitted with a wide variety of different attachments such as buckets, breakers and grapples. The most distinctive feature of the crawler excavators is the undercarriage, which is usually equipped with steel tracks or can sometimes be used with rubber tracks depending on what the environment is. Crawler excavators are ideal for heavy lifting, digging or earth moving tasks, such as digging drainage trenches, foundations or clearing the sites. They can also effectively move earth and rocks in the mining style jobs and can also be used in forestry works with specialised attachments suited to those jobs, including removing trees, stumps and debris. Sizes range from 10 tonnes to 90 tonnes depending on the model of your machine. Prices usually range from £100,000 to £500,000 depending on what model of your excavator and the additions to your purchase. Number two is the mini excavators. Mini excavators are the compact version of the standard excavators designed for jobs where space is limited. They have increased agility and also are easier to transport. The small lightweight design of the mini excavators minimizes ground impact, making them perfect for delicate areas with underground utilities or pipe work. Mini excavators are best suited for jobs like digging drainage trenches, foundations, or even light demolition work especially when paired with attachments like micro trenching buckets, grading beams and tilt grading buckets. They are ideal for projects in urban areas such as residential landscaping or renovation tasks. Sizes range from 0.75 tonnes to 10 tonnes depending on the model of your excavator. Prices usually range from £10,000 to £100,000 depending on the model of excavator you go for and the specs. Number three, long reach excavators. Long reach excavators have a longer arm or boom compared to standard excavators, which then allows them to reach much further distances from one spot. They are specifically designed to do jobs that require work at distance or depth. The extended reach makes them invaluable for working in areas where you can't track up to the area you need to work in or excavate. An example of this is working next to water on a bank. These are most commonly used in dredging operations or underwater projects. Sizes range from four ton to hundred ton and have a reach up to hundred feet or 30 meters. Prices usually start from 30,000 pounds. The price will be affected by any additions or specifications you need. Number four, wheeled excavators. Wheeled excavators usually perform like your standard excavator, but they have wheels instead of tracks. This allows them to easily maneuver around urban areas or flat surfaces. They are usually more unstable than the tracked excavators on rougher surfaces. However, these are usually preferred on flat, even surfaces where you don't want to damage the surface that you're working on, such as road construction or utility installation when operating on finished pavement. Wheeled excavators can usually fit all the attachments that you'd usually fit to a standard excavator. However, the digging depth is slightly reduced because of the height of the wheels. These machines usually range from five to 25 ton. Prices typically range from 50,000 pounds to 300,000 pounds, depending on your machine specs and requirements. Number five is spider excavators. Spider excavators or walking excavators feature extendable legs instead of tracks. The legs can be individually extended or retracted to keep the cab level. This is even on very tough terrain or a steep angle. This essentially allows them to walk across uneven terrain. Their versatility allows them to work in terrain where standard excavators or any other excavator would struggle with the terrain, such as on mountain slopes, forests, or in flooded areas. Spider excavators are usually found working in forestry, riverbank reinforcement, or mountainous terrains. Sizes range typically from 10 to 15 tons, and the price tag ranges from 
£50,000 to £250,000 depending on what model of excavator and your specifications. Number six, backhoe excavators. Backhoe excavators are usually known as backhoe loaders or backhoes. They're a combination of a standard front loader and excavator. The backhoe features a larger bucket at the front or loader with a dipper arm at the back with a smaller size bucket. The combination allows it to perform multiple functions such as bulk moving or precision digging with one machine. Backhoes are usually used for trench digging or earth moving on small construction sites or farms. They are particularly useful for jobs such as installing drainage or even moving potatoes around a farm. The rear arm of the backhoe can usually be fitted with all the buckets and attachments that a standard excavator would use, offering more versatility with one machine. This is especially useful for farmers or landscapers that can use the flail mowers to cut hedges or land rakes to remove debris from a large area. Sizes range from five to 10 tons and typically have a price range of 20,000 pounds to 100,000 pounds. Number seven, hydraulic shovel excavators. Hydraulic shovel excavators are extremely large machines typically used in mining or large scale earth moving projects. These excavators have a very powerful arm and a large bucket designed to remove as much earth as possible. The hydraulic system gives them a superior lifting power or digging force. Hydraulic shovels are essential for open pit mining or large scale construction projects where a large amount of earth is needing to be moved for the construction. Sizes range from 150 tonnes to 650 tonnes. Prices can be typically £500,000 up to a few million pounds depending on the size of the machine. Number eight, dragline excavators. Dragline excavators are larger machines that are typically used in civil engineering or mining applications. These use a long arm with a suspended bucket which is operated with a system of cables. The bucket is dragged along the surface to collect the material and then the material is dumped elsewhere. Dragline excavators are most commonly used in strip mining where they remove material to expose coal or other minerals. Their long reach makes them ideal for operating on large surface areas like open pit mines or large waterways. Available in sizes up to 7,000 tonnes for the larger style excavators. Prices typically start from around one million pounds. Number nine, suction excavators. Suction excavators or vacuum excavators use a powerful suction to break up and remove the debris. They sometimes use water pressure to loosen the soil before excavating. These machines are highly precise and cause minimal damage to the surrounding area, making these ideal for excavating around underground utilities to prevent any damage. Suction excavators are primarily used for utility work around urban areas, such as digging around gas mains, water pipes, and other sensitive areas. Sizes can vary from 10 to 40 tonnes, and prices range from 40,000 pounds to 150,000 pounds. And finally, number 10, is amphibious excavators. Amphibious excavators are designed to work in wet environments. Amphibious excavators are fitted with pontoons rather than the standard excavator tracks, which allows them to float and maneuver through waterlogged areas. These machines can work in marshes, rivers, or shallow lakes without getting stuck or damaged. Amphibious excavators are typically used for dredging waterways or working on projects in flooded or swampy areas. They are commonly used for coastal restoration, flood management and building structures in aquatic areas. Sizes usually range from 3 tonnes to 40 tonnes and pricing ranges from £40,000 to £150,000. Now you know the top 10 types of excavator, why not check out the video here for the top 10 excavator buckets and don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss out on another video. Number 9. Suction, uh, <laughs> suction, ah, oh, water kiss, or walking excavators, and used in forest, uh, forest study.